you can see. Today, we are going to solve a beautiful geometry question. Geometry is one of my favorite subjects. The question we are going to solve today can also be solved with trigonometry. But I have bad news for trig lovers. You have to use geometry to solve this. Otherwise, it would be too easy to solve it. I am very excited to solve the question, but I am also curious about your favorite math subject. Please share it with me in the comments. Okay, now let's start it, my friends. Today we will try to solve a very nice geometry question. There are three squares here, and we will find x plus y plus c. We add three more equal squares to the three equal squares in the question. This red line will be our first step to solve this question. When the hypotenuses and pair of corresponding sides of right triangles are congruent, the triangles are congruent. The red line is the hypotenuse of a triangle. And these two red triangles are congruent, so angles should be the same. Therefore, this angle is also equal to y. This third red triangle and the other two triangles are congruent for the same reason. So, this angle of the third red triangle is equal to y. We can find other angles easily now. The adjacent complementary angle is equal to 90 minus y. This angle is also equal to y because the triangles are again congruent. We add y to 90 minus y, and we find that this angle is equal to 90. Because the sides of this right triangle are equal, the angles are equal to 45. of the square is the angle bisector, so x is also equal to 45. So, we can write x when we see 45. You see, it is between y and c. Sum of x, y, and z is equal to 90. I hope you like it. See you next time, my friends. Are we done with shooting? <laughs>